It's so fun to enjoy your sunny flower garden with an assortment of colorful blooming flowers that really give off all those great scents and attract butterflies and hummingbirds. But did you know that there are some flowers that only bloom in the evening or at night when the temperatures cool down and the moonlight then replaces the sunshine? This morning on You Can Grow at Jim tells us about a whole range of flowers with beautiful blooms that only open up during the long summer evenings. They're just as fragrant as their daylight cousins and beautiful by the light of the moon. Take a look. Summer is officially here and with it those long pleasant evenings after a hot sunny day. But as the sun sets and the moon comes up, other different beautiful flowers begin to bloom offering sweet fragrances and attracting nighttime pollinators of their own. Here are a few that you can grow in your own moon garden. First, the moonflower. It's a perennial in warmer areas, but thrives as an annual here in Idaho. It prefers full sun and blooms in summer and fall. Moonflower is a vining plant that grows well on a trellis or arched entryway and produces large white flowers that open at night and have a sweet, delicate fragrance. Pollinating moths love them, and its attractive heart-shaped green leaves make for a very pretty plant during the day when the flowers aren't in bloom. Four o'clocks are also perennials, although are grown as annuals in cooler areas of Idaho. They thrive in full sun and part shade and also bloom summer to fall. They're called four o'clocks because they open in the late afternoon and early evening. Flowers from the previous day wilt in the heat, making way for new blossoms in the evening. They grow as small shrubby plants and are a nice addition to borders and patios, blooming profusely in many different colors. The chocolate daisy is a low maintenance member of the aster family and will bloom for months with cheery yellow flowers with red centers that put out a chocolatey scent. It's native to the southwest U.S. so it's drought tolerant and thrives in Idaho pollinator gardens. They'll bloom from spring through fall in full sun or part shade. The flowers bloom at twilight and are most fragrant near dawn. It grows about one to two feet tall and makes a good border for a walkway. Night Phlox is a relative of snapdragons, planted in full sun and it will produce blossoms from summer through fall in shades of white, purple, and deep red. The flowers open around sunset, releasing their distinctive fragrance that's been described as honeyed vanilla and almond with a touch of spice. Night Phlox is an annual, so it must be planted each year, but it makes a great filler between larger plants. Here's an Idaho favorite. In fact, it's our state flower, the syringa or mock orange. It's a deciduous shrub, which means that it loses its leaves in winter, but is very hardy to all Idaho zones. It's a large shrub with dense foliage, so it makes a good privacy hedge. The four-petaled white flowers resemble orange blossoms and are very fragrant. The blossoms will open in succession at night for several weeks through spring and summer. In full bloom, it almost glows in the moonlight. Here's one you might recognize from bridal bouquets. The Casablanca lily is prized for its large, long-lasting and fragrant white flowers that bloom from mid to late summer in full sun or part shade. The creamy white blooms unfurl their petals in the evening, releasing their fragrance and can remain open for up to two weeks. This lily grows three to four feet tall with clusters of up to eight large, lustrous flowers that also tend to glow in the moonlight as well as in sunshine. Finally, here are two night bloomers that are similar but opposite at the same time. But be careful where you plant them if you have children and pets because they are poisonous. Angel's trumpet grows well in Idaho, but only during the warm summer months. The large trumpet-shaped flowers are 6 to 12 inches long in colors from white to yellow to pink and hang downward from green leafy branches. The flowers open at night and last from one to four days, and they're pollinated at night by moths. In contrast is the devil's trumpet, sometimes known as jimson weed. Its flowers are similar to angel's trumpets, but rather than hanging down, they turn upwards. They're usually white with bits of lavender or pink on the throat and edges. The plant has thick, shrubby foliage with a bluish tint. The flowers open in the evening and smell like honeysuckle, and it draws pollinators like the giant sphinx moth. So there you go, some choices to plant in your own moon garden, where you can enjoy beautiful blooms and rich fragrances in the long summer evenings around sunset and into the night. And you can grow it. Well, white or light colored flowers work best in moon gardens since they'll reflect the moonlight better, but many daylight blooming flowers will stay open through the night and they can be incorporated into a moon garden as well. And these Beautiful. calm evenings with the cooler air allows that fragrance to really linger yes. around. So on the patio or out on the back porch, you can smell those flowers in the evening. It's just so pretty. Yeah, we've got long evenings now. Yeah, we do. Time, yes, so we do. Nice All right. Thanks, Jim, for that.